The Dallas Mavericks select Rolando Blackman. The anticipation of next season dims the memory of the difficulty of bringing the NBA to Dallas. After general manager Norm Sanju's 18-month pursuit of the franchise finally cleared the last hurdle in late April, a whirlwind of activity ensued to put the pieces together. Finally, in September of 1980, veteran coach Dick Mata assembled 20 players at the North Dallas practice site. 16 veterans and four rookies answered the roll call as the Mavericks prepared to enter the NBA wars for the very first time. September 26th marked the official Dallas NBA debut of the Mavericks, and 15,634 fans were on hand to see the show at the fabulous new Reunion Arena. Philadelphia held on to win the preseason contest 113 to 108, but this game would set the tone for the season. Don't take the young Mavericks for granted. They would go as far as hustle and determination could take them. The original Mavericks that took the floor for the official league opener against the San Antonio Spurs on October 11, 1980, started Tom Lagarde at center, Abdul Jelani and Jerome Whitehead at forwards, and Winfred Boynes and Jeff Houston in the backcourt. No one knew what to expect Would the Mavericks race out of the gate or just stumble. Coach Dick Mata orchestrated the young Mavericks to a surprising lead, directing the historic opening win, Maestro Mata.